Hey guys, Caleb with PowerShades here. Follow along with our videos to make sure that your installations go by quickly and easily. Now we know our measurement between our dry fit shade with the end caps on it, and we also know the measurement for our window. So now what I need to do is I need to bring it back in an eighth of an inch so that for this particular shade, since it has a fascia on it, the fascia will be flush. So I'm gonna bring it back an eighth of an inch. So I'm gonna go ahead and measure this back an eighth of an inch. And then I'm gonna go ahead and take uh, my bracket and I'm gonna go ahead and get it flush against that mark. And then I'll be able to put a dot right in the center of my mounting holes. So now I know where I need to pre-drill my holes. All right, so now we're just gonna do the other side. So we're gonna go an eighth inch in the window jam. Then we're gonna hold our uh, control side bracket up, flush it up against that mark and make our, whoop, Make sure it's flush. And then we're gonna make two more marks for our drill marks. And now we're ready to drill. So then we're gonna install our idler in first by sliding the shade on. So when you are installing the motor side, um, you've got this little white tab that's gonna need to go out in order to snap in. So the easiest way uh, to simplify this is take a flathead screwdriver, push it all the way up, and then put your flathead screwdriver against the tab and then just bend it, push it out a little bit. And it gets up and over that black tab. And you'll hear it kind of pop in. And there you go, now you're installed. And then just take your extra wire and kind of find a place if you've got, if they're hardwired, you can tuck it back up into your hole. If they're battery operated, you can tuck it back inside of your bracket because your facial will snap over and you won't be able to see it. It gives you a nice clean look. Okay, now we're ready to install our fascia. We have a little lip on the top side of the fascia. So it's got this kind of bottom lip here. That's, that's gonna sit on the bottom like this. So we'll take this top lip, slide it in flat, and it's actually gonna hook on this piece right here on the bracket. So we're gonna do that on both sides, line it up, and then it should pivot down like this and then just snap it at the bottom. And now you're installed.